talk too many games. Now we gotta play them all. So what about the steam train? Choo choo. Hey. Hi there. Welcome back to Steam Train. Uh, Ross is still fighting this guy. Uh, it's been 24 Don't hours. Don't the blame on me. Since the last the uh, time. On me. Yeah. Um. Yeah, in the break, I had to take a poo. Uh, I, I, my butt hole burned afterwards, so I used the Aaron's bidet. Aaron's oh, bidet. Have you used the bidet before? Uh, once. It's delightful. It's pretty good. For those of you that don't know what a bidet is, it's a thing that squirts water at your butthole. <laughs> <laughs> that simple, really. You, you know the classiest way to say things. It, yeah, it, 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 it's shaped like a toilet, but it just gently you know, sprays a little fountain. You know Let me explain this, Ross! Okay. Just like, like shoots a little fountain of, of, of warm water into into your... Where you really need it. Into your, Whoa, yeah. Got super airborne. Into your nethers. But you gotta be careful not to burn your treasures, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, I gotcha, I gotcha. <laughs> that can happen. You know, um... Man, like, my- when I think of bidets, I always think of, uh, what, what's it called? Um, Crocodile Dundee. Did you see that- you see that movie, right? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, the good part of the movie where he's, like, in the hotel. No, I don't know if this is the first one or second one, but he, like, um, he, he, like, takes a drink out of the bidet. He's like, oh my god, we got a drinking fountain and everything, and he, like- <laughs> Oh, has, gross. Has a, he drinks out of the bidet because he's, like, thirsty. Yuck. Oh, man. They're, they're, I was- Wild Bushman. I always think of Todd Barry talking about how he yeah. saw, like, Nelly, like, that rapper yeah. on, uh, on cribs, and it clearly, like a lot of times on MTV cribs and stuff, they won't yeah. uh, actually have the uh, actual house of the person it's prete who's pretending to live there. It'll really? just be like a house. Yeah, it'll just be like some house that they go to and pretend to film at. Are you serious? Oh yeah, of course. Cribs isn't real. Yeah. Oh I, my god. I can't believe it. You know what's actually funny? MTV reality shows are full of shit. Did you know? Um. Oh, I don't know to what extent I'm allowed to talk about this, but uh. I mean, Holly was on that reality show, uh, yes. the Heroes of Cosplay one. I haven't actually talked about this at all. Like, right. It sprung up on the subreddit a million times because people saw me on like TV, I guess. Because right. like, I guess I was like in a few shots because it was filmed in our house. <laughs> you, I don't know if you heard that, but someone has a musical horn outside. Yeah. <laughs> so somebody had like that, did 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 like as if to like signify the humble brag. Yeah, trumpet and pronounce the humble brag. <laughs> Amazing. Awesome. Humble brag. <laughs> yeah. Anyway, um, so Holly was on the show. It's called Heroes of Cosplay. It's like this. Uh, Holly's my wife. For those of you that don't know, who's right. tuning in. Holly Conrad. Um, Holly beautiful Conrad. Holly Conrad. Beautiful Holly Conrad. And um, anyway, a uh, few shots since it was filmed in the house. I appear. Um, and it's just since since doing that show like I was watching some reality TV last night on Netflix uh, I was watching um, I think like doomsday bunkers or something and it's about like people who prep for like oh uh, yeah doomsday and it was just kind of like some of them were like ridiculous like I saw a dream in my head and there were and meteors were falling from the sky and I'm oh, just yeah. like you're fucking crazy yes yeah, so but ridiculous. like some of the bits where they're just like you know, my crew's gonna be walking in here, and then we're, I'm gonna shoot them with this turret I built, and it's just, you just watch them, like, badly act as they, like, pretend they don't know it's coming. Right. And it's just, like, uh, like, just all these flashbacks to, like, um, you know, like, being on a reality TV get set. Get to the other like, side, Ross, man. Like, get, you know, like, do, do the thing again. I know, I'm trying to. I'm okay. Just, just, I'm trying to get the cake so I can do it. Um, but it's just, it's just, yeah, like, reality TV is kind of, like, ruined for me now. I'm just, like... Dude, reality I don't really watch TV. Watch much of it though, to be honest. Reality TV should be ruined for everybody. <laughs> yeah, I'm not a big reality TV guy. It's terrible. Yeah. Uh, the um. Here's a cosplay though. Yeah, yeah. That's oh, pretty good. Yeah. Oh, uh, here a good. My wife's on it. Yeah. Good shows aside. Yeah. Uh, you know what I did used to watch? Uh, oh. Brett Michaels Rock of Love. I don't even know what that is. Oh, it was terrible. Terribly good. Terribly good. Um, Brett Michaels, the former lead singer of Poison. Yeah. Um, uh. Who I met one time actually, and yeah, because yeah, uh, I wanted um, I, I wanted him to be a douchebag so badly because like he kind of seems douchey a little bit on the show, um, yeah, and it just would have been hilarious. But dude, he he's alternated. No, he wasn't on that side before. Oh, he, he was wasn't. Was yeah, he was on the face. Weird. Weird. Um, but he Brett Michaels was actually a really cool guy, and I was like, yeah. God damn it. <laughs> I was bummed out, but yeah, the, you bummed out. Someone wasn't a mean person. Yeah, I actually, you know, um, oh my god, this is a bit of a humble brag. Um, I was a uh, my one, one of my my aunt. She's a uh, one of dude. If you know it's gonna be a humble brag, then just turn it into a real brag. Just brag. Oh, okay. Yeah. Uh, my my aunt. Um, her her dad's. Cause it's open, Ross. I'm trying, but I keep getting hit before I get fucking to it. Um, my um my aunt's. 
dad's best friend is the- What the fuck? I'm just touching it and dying! <laughs> I'm not doing- Watch shoot, it! Shoot it from the- shoot it from the ridge, dude! I can't! Uh, There's, it's not open yet, I'm trying to hit the button! But for some reason when I get near it, I'm just dying, even that the, the lasers aren't hitting me. I, I'm really confused. I think it was open. It wasn't open. Every- every time you see, like, the glowing white on it, top- There was no glowing white. Was there? There was. Was there? Okay, now there is. Yeah. Are you saying it's a little less now? There you oh, go. Oh, we did it. Yeah! I'm oh, sorry, I was telling a story, wasn't I? Hold um, on, wait. Okay. Let's enjoy this. No, we did it. Yes. Okay. Oh. Anyway, so my, my aunt's dad's God. um best friend is the electronica guy. For, is this is this this is new? Is the electronica guy for uh, Muse, the band? Oh yeah, awesome. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And um, it's me. Oh, let's hear this first. Bad news. Her evil self's gone back in time. He wants to give us D or B days before this whole thing starts. <laughs> oh, no, what are we gonna do? You're gonna go inside yourself and cure it. What? Hold still. Wait, should we do it? Oh, awesome. <laughs> oh, oh, nice. No. You're inside yourself, oh, curing yourself uh, of diabetes. Okay, so anyway, um... As we all knew this would come to. My... Anyway, I had a connection to some guy who was like the electronic guy from Muse, and um, he like kind of worked off stage and did like all the electronic beats and stuff. Right. And uh, he was in town in Perth for a concert called uh, Big Day Out, mm -hmm. and uh, we got VIP. Um, oh, can I just die now? What's going on? You're fine. Oh, dead. <laughs> and we got VIP tickets, so we actually got to go on stage while like Matt Bellamy and all them were like playing Muse. So I was like literally like a few meters away from the like the entire band just right. playing in front of like three thousand people. It was like fucking very amazing. Cool. Um, but, uh, afterwards, we got invited to this, like, um, it was kind of like, it was like a, I guess, like, band party mm -hmm. for, like, everyone that played there. So, like, there was a lot of really famous people there, and right. I'm just, like, this, like, I was really young. I was, actually, well, I was super young. I was probably early 20s. And I was, like, um, at this party, and, like, all the guys from Muse are literally having drinks, like, right next to me. Awesome. And I'm, like, at the bar, like, standing right next to them. And I'm, like, I was a huge Muse fan at the time. Like, I really liked them. They're good. Um... Nice. But I like I, I would I couldn't I couldn't I couldn't pull myself to talk to them because I uh, thought like maybe they were gonna be jerks. Uh, but I mean they're probably not. But I'm just saying like if they were at the time it probably would have crushed me. Right. So you just kind of like avoid talking to them because you're just like I don't want to take the chance. Yeah, it no. always hurts when like you meet your idols and they're not that cool. Yeah, that's kind of a bummer. It's I I think I've been pretty lucky with that. Like yeah, ever I mean everyone that I like really respect I've met and they've been like really swell. Yeah, people. they've been really cool. I feel like generally, like, if someone does something cool for a living, they're probably pretty cool. I mean, well... Yeah, not always, certainly. Not always, I'm sure, but, like... I mean, like, we had that... I had, uh, a, I, I had a joking conversation with Dan. I don't believe this is the truth. Uh, but I was like, we're talking about actors. And I think someone said that like, <laughs> Tom, Tom Hanks is, like, one of the nicest actors in Hollywood. Yes. People say that. Yes. And, I mean, he's got, like, a warm, gentle face. He looks like he'd be a really nice guy. Right, I want to touch his face. Yeah, but someone else said, like... Uh, like, oh my god, you know, like, um, Robert Downey Jr. is so good at acting like a rich asshole. It's like, well, <laughs> maybe he is a rich asshole. There's a chance! No, I, 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 I mean, obviously, I don't know. I, mean, I don't know. I'm, I'm sure he's a nice guy. I'm just kidding. It, it, no, I mean, I feel like because he went through, like, some serious shit. Oh, he did, he, he had some, like, drug addiction, didn't yeah, he? Yeah, he had very serious drug addiction, and, like, this was a long time ago already, but there was a time when he was so fucked up on drugs he like accidentally like crawled into the window of the wrong house and like fell asleep in like a little kid's bed are you fucking with me well you know yeah he was just like so wasted out of his mind i guess that was a while ago uh because some people have what forgotten. would you do if you like mommy mommy iron man's in my bed this was way before iron man i know but it's he was definitely known yeah yeah um I don't know. I don't know what I would do, is the answer. I actually think that was what happens in the third movie. Like, he, like, he, the kid finds him in his garage. Oh, uh, that, then that might have been, like, a little, like, wink, wink, nudge, nudge towards it. Yeah. But yeah, he, um, I think because he went through, like, that, that kind of stuff has to really, like, humble you and, like... Yeah. Yeah. So, maybe because he's been through some serious shit. Yeah, very possible, very possible. Oh, nice. Get, get that out of the way early. <laughs> Damn it. Doing a bad job here. No, it's fine. Get that hat. Oh, I uh, could probably get that hat. That's a pretty easy hat to get. Well, that'll be your next time. Yeah. Why yeah, can't oh. I get it? Oh, I won't give it to you if you... Oh, there no, I got you. it. I, unless I die. Yeah. Oh, I think I got the evil guy's head. Dude, we should... Why not put on one of these hats? I don't know. Why haven't we put on a hat? Yeah. I don't know how to. Can oh. I have B? Hats. hats. 
Oh, there you go. That. Yeah, you Dovacan, can look like anyone you want to. Dovacan, uh... Look at that sweet wizard hat. This oh, guy. do the burger. Do the burger. Bottom yeah. row. Hot dog. Oh, dude, how can you not be the raptor? Oh, uh, well. Oh, evil guy is pretty cool. Wizard... Oh, the... Yeah, that's oh, cool. adorable. But, but you know what? I'm... I'm <laughs> <laughs> uh... I love it! <laughs> I don't know why we didn't take advantage of this before! Oh, it's so funny. It's such oh, a great really part of the game. I'm really bad at this. There you are. Hey, next time on Steam Chain, yeah. more burger action. And I'll get better at this. Nah.